Hey guys, back with another X-Plane 11 video. This time a little technical video to help you out if you're having some frame rate issues. This is something that I found that's helped me improve frame rates. You do this every once in a while. Uh, if you start to see your frame rates kind of lag a little bit, you'll, you can find this on the xplane.org forum and other places. Uh, but it's a, it's a simple fix that can sometimes help your frame rates. So what you want to do is we're going to be deleting the preferences. Now don't be too worried about that first make a backup copy of it just in case so you have that and you can throw that away after everything is solid even uh, 11 our research uh, on their x-plane 11 knowledge base talks about deleting preferences saying deleting x-plane preferences is an easy way to reset the simulator to its default settings after a setting has been changed that caused x-plane to crash it is also a good idea to delete the preferences after updating the simulator due to the fact that the preferences files are continually changing. All right, so this is something that you can do on a regular basis to keep things clean within your X-Plane 11 system. But you want to go to your program files, X-Plane 11 output preferences, okay? And the first thing you want to do is you want to take these three files, calibration, joystick settings, and keys, and you want to make a copy of them, okay? Because this, what, what we're going to do is we're actually going to be deleting this whole folder and then what happens is X-Plane, once it boots up, starts up, it'll create that preferences folder again and all the files in it. And what's that, once that's done, we're going to overwrite these three files here onto that so we don't have to recalibrate uh, the yoke or your joystick or your key, keyboards, your key settings. And what you're going to do now is you're going to basically throw this away, okay? And then I'm going to start up uh, X-Plane 11 and you're going to see the preferences are going to be created again. So let's do that. All right, so I started up X-Plane 11 again. You can see my preferences are back. And then what I want to do is I'm going to open this up. I'm going to take these three files here, and I'm going to place them over, and I'm going to replace them. And now I have all my calibration and joystick settings and my keyboard settings already set up. So again, this should help, can help, I should say, frame rates. It doesn't always work, but this can help improve frame rates. Do it every once in a while. I do it, you know, like every week or so uh, just to clean things out. You know, obviously, uh, Laminar should have a way to do this without having to go through this, but it is what it is. So hopefully this was helpful. Hit the like button if you like what you saw. Don't forget to subscribe to Bambino Games and hit that little bell icon if you want to get notifications as to when I put up new videos. So thanks for watching, guys, and have a great day.